Hey, what's up guys? Tim here. Got another quick tutorial for you today. And I'm just showing you a basic on how to set up the double cow's hitch on buckles. This is the buckle core and it's a two strand core. And this is just how to make things look really nice and clean with the uh, double cow's hitch on each end. I use this method in my sanctified bracelet tutorial. As you can see here, I've got two cow's hitch up there and two there. So I just wanted to make this video as kind of a placeholder video, that way I don't have to incorporate this part into the into every tutorial, that way I can always just refer back to this one. Alright, so that being said, let's get into the tutorial. Okay, so I've got my piece of paracord here, now this isn't actually uh, long enough to do an actual bracelet, just for de uh, demo purposes. I've got an extra large buckle, uh, this is actually a lot larger than I actually use um, on a bracelet, but I just want to use a really big buckle, just to be really clear, okay? So, uh, when you're starting your bracelet, um, you know, this will probably be your main weaving strands. You're going to start just about, I'd say about the midpoint. Um, you can give yourself like a little more paracord on, a little more length on the one side, and you'll see why in a sec. So, I'm just going to double it over. It's got a few inches extra on this strand. So we're going to start with one end of the buckle, it doesn't really matter which one. We're going to start with a sort of single cow's hitch on one side. So I'm going to push this through to just put the loop through the front there, like that. And then we're going to pull both strands through one side, like this. We're going to pull it shut. So we have a single cow hitch on one side. And this is my slightly longer strand. It doesn't really matter if it's even or not. You can adjust it after. So from here, we're going to take the strand on the right and go through the front of the buckle like this. Okay. And we're going to bring it back through this loop here. And pull that shut. So we went through the front. Now we're going to come through the back, this side. So go through the back of the buckle, bring it back through this loop we just created here. Boom. Now we have a double cow's hitch on this one end. So as you can see, I gave myself, uh, saying to give yourself a little more excess on this side, just so that these are a little more even. They're almost even. You can always adjust that later. Not a big deal. Okay, so that is the first side of the buckle. Now we can switch over to the other side. So now we're going to do the other side. We're going to bring our two working ends onto this side. So from here, we grab our other buckle, and now we're going to form another two sort of double cow's hitch on this side. So I'm going to do this strand up top. So we're going to go through the front again. And we're going to bring the strand on this side to the left. This is where you would set up your length too. So, you know, you would adjust your length accordingly. Now this is going to be a lot shorter just for demo purpose. So we got the strand on to the left. We're going to bring it across the front, and again, now we're, we went uh, through the front now to end, we're going to go through the back just like the last time. The back like this, and then we're going to go through this little loop here again. And then there. We have a single cow's hitch like that. Now we're going to do the same thing on the other side. We're going to go through the front at first. This, now again, this is where you would make your strands equal for your uh, bracelet. Okay, and then we're going to bring this strand over on top of the strand here. And then we're going to go behind through the back of the buckle. Like this, through the back of the buckle, and then through the loop we just created here. Like that. And pull it shut. 
So think of it as a um, strand going through the front and then it goes out this way. Both strands went out this way and that way and you bring it again through the back. So front, out, and then back. Hope that makes sense. <laughs> okay, so now we've got the two cow's hitches set up here and there we have it. So as you can see we're ready to weave our bracelet. Uh, this is the uh, double cow's hitch with the uh, two strand core and of course you want to make sure these are even. I'm going to sort of adjust this, make that one the two strands even like this and you are ready to weave your bracelet. Okay and that's it. So we have our double cow's hitch on both ends and the two strand core and these are, will be our working strands. We're ready to make our bracelet. Okay. So that's about it. Uh, I just wanted to make this video as kind of like a placeholder video because I do plan on using this um, setup for a lot of future tutorials. All right. So hope you guys enjoyed, enjoyed this tutorial. I'll see you in the next video.